Okay, uh, it's been a while since I've done a video. It's been about two, three weeks. Um, obviously, the heat waves had a massive effect, and of course, I've started my new job. So, work has taken precedence, um, and I'm focusing my energies on that. But I have decided, because I bought two new hockey jerseys, that um, here we are, we're going to do a hockey jersey video. Another, you know, two new jerseys added to the collection. Uh, so, we're going to start with the Croatia National jersey replica. I got this for 60 quid in my local club shop at the Bracknell Bees. Some guy donated this last year uh it went unsold uh for the whole last season um i had my eye on it and i thought you know what maybe of course croatia obviously played england in the world cup semi-final the other week and the club shop was open and i forgot to go down but i was going to buy this and i realized probably wise that i didn't um uh, but it goes well with the, the the croatia hat you may have seen me wearing a few live streams and a few videos um Beautiful jersey, love the colours, uh, national colours. I have been to Croatia. I, I do work with a lot of um, people from the Balkans. I work with Macedonians, uh, Serbians. Um, I work with people from the former Yugoslavia. It's kind of nice to have one of these. Um, uh, it's, it's, it's an interesting part of the world. Not famed for their ice hockey, but I love the colours. I love the flag. I love, you know, look at the striping. I mean, you couldn't get no more beautiful than that it's a simple jersey but it is stunning um absolutely stunning and for 60 quid you know for a rare jersey like that because not many of these will be made uh, croatia is not famed for being a hockey nation uh, they're ranked far lower than the uk they're they're really not really known as an ice hockey nation they're more famed for their handball their tennis uh their football obviously they're not famed for their ice hockey um now, the next one um, is a beer league jersey that I found. I don't know where Matt's moves are from. Probably Canadian. Um, I'm not a big fan of the black writing than the yellow writing. Uh, I will admit. It would have looked better if that was all black or all yellow. But I have to admit, the colour scheme, beautiful. Uh, if you're a Bruins fan, if you're a Penguins fan, uh, any team that plays in black and yellow and white, you're going to love this. Um, I got this for 60 quid as well yesterday. I had my eye on this for a year again. Same, same, probably the same person donated. Someone donated this. Name on the back, number. Um, probably the most comfortable jersey I think I've ever worn. Uh, that says a lot. Uh, it's made by who makes it? Uh, Shine Dog Ice Gear. So you know, it's it's good quality. Um, the name part, you know, the, the stitching is, is amazing. Um, and to be fair, for a beer league jersey or an amateur team jersey, this is not bad. You know. For, you know, a bunch of mates getting a team together. It's not bad. I don't know if it's Canadian. I don't know if it's American, British, European. I don't know where it's from. But I have to admit, whoever came up with the idea for Matt's Moose, absolute genius. It probably is Canadian. It's probably a beer league jersey. But that is probably one of the best jerseys I've ever worn. I've had me on it for a year. How that hadn't got sold is unbeknownst to me. Um, so comfortable to wear. My work, my workshop gets a bit warm. I was totally comfortable wearing that today. Uh, it has not been as warm today, but I wouldn't wear that in the heat wave we've had. But in the middle of August wearing that, I was fine. Um, I want some more information on Matt Smoots. So if anyone out there in the hockey world knows who Matt Smoots are, I will be so, so interested to find out if it's a beer league team or an amateur team or just a bunch of mates came up with this idea on a stag do or anything. Because someone donated that. I bought it for 60 quid. Um, all the funds that I've spent today go back into the running of the Randall Bees ice hockey team and the club itself. So I've done something good today, or well, yesterday. <laughs> and I've got more jerseys to come. I'll be buying all the Randall Bees three jerseys that they're releasing this season. Uh, later on this month, I'll be buying the white home, the black home, and the yellow cup jersey. So you're going to see some funky jerseys turning up. Um, that Matt Smooth one's going to get worn a lot. Might wear it in the live stream tonight. The Croatia one, I do love it, but I'm not wearing it in the live stream just in case there's that angry football fan on here who may go, why are you wearing that? But that Matt's Moose is brilliant. Um, but anyway, thank you for you know bearing with me. And we have gained some subscribers as well since I've been away. We've gained like four or five subscribers just in the last few days, and I haven't posted a video for three weeks. So I don't know where you guys are coming from, but I thank you you know, for your, you know, your subscriptions and your comments and, 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 and your views, because without... How should I put it? You guys, the channel is pointless. And this is a hobby. And if I make money out of it, I make money out of it. Uh, but I do enjoy my current job. It's, it's brilliant. I'm working with electricals, which is something that you know I've done before. But yeah, thank you very much for sticking with me. Um, and yeah, two more jerseys added to the collection. Um, so thank you very much. 
place your thoughts below. Any information on Matt's moves would be much appreciated. I have no idea where that jersey comes from. It's probably Canadian. Absolutely epic. Whoever came up with that idea is a genius. Um, the logo is pretty cool as well. Um, and to Matt, thank you very much. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. Please like and subscribe, place your comments below, and I'll have a live stream for you very shortly.